Welcome. This is probably going to be one of the shortest videos that I ever done <laughs> because I'm just going to explain uh, something I did in a Rago fire that was technically a fail, but eventually turned out in a really beautiful way, I think. I was trying to do a pot with this um, blue-ish glaze, Turkish uh, glaze, maybe I should get a bit closer. Um, I really like this glaze, it's, uh, it's produced nice crackles and, um, and it's a really beautiful color. Um, and it, it usually works really well, it's easy to apply, you can brush it, you can pour it, you can spray it. Um, it's a very, very simple recipe, it's 80% um, um, Gersley Borat and 20% uh, corny stone and then a couple of percent of uh, copper carbonate. You can use other colorants too, produce the same result. I really, really like how, how it, um, I don't know how sharp it gets here, um, but yeah, now you can see it. Uh, I did spray some air onto it after I took it out of the, uh, out of the kiln to um, get better cracking, but it does look really nice. So I was doing um, another vase. I was trying to reproduce the same result, but I did one mistake. I totally forgot that when you burnish, um, or if you use terra cigalata on a pot, the glaze won't stick. So I glazed a pot and I um, fired it. Everything went well. I took it out and then I realized that the glaze was kind of crackling off. Um, so instead of throwing it out, I decided, well, I try and, and take all of the glaze off and underneath it <laughs> out came something that actually looks like, um, actually looks like uh, naked raku, although <laughs> it isn't. Uh, it's um, a glazed pot, there was terza gelada, but then the glaze uh, fell off or I had to peel it off. And underneath was this beautiful pattern, sort of like a naked uh, raku, and a beautiful, very dark, <laughs> deep, dark uh, top. And uh, as you can see, some of the Tessigalata also got scraped off. Um, and underneath it is the red uh, clay. But I like the, 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 the colors it gives, the variation of white and, and reddish, um, and with the beautiful dark stri stripes. I think. This is technically a fail, but I love it. I love it. If you like my videos like this, and also the longer ones I do on how I actually produce uh, my pit fire and ragu pottery, how I wheel throw and all that, please subscribe to my channel. And of course, you're also welcome to share or ask any questions. If you have any, I'll do my best to answer it. And now my chickens are making noise in the background. I hope to see you soon again. Have a great day.